Yo, yo, what's going on? It's your boy Loco, host of four of his number one YouTube channel. Your boy Loco TV. Subscribe to my channel. It's People of Four River, episode eight, with Big Sticks Roy. Yo, watch this dude, man. He's a real great. Look at me. You haven't seen well, it? I need to talk to Roy. Going, Roy, I needed to talk, ask you a couple questions. Uh, I'm, okay. I'm just gonna walk with you. If you don't mind. That guy, that guy interrupted us. He screwed up our whole thing. You got your cigarette out of it. It's all that matters. That guy's a winner. Uh, he's, he's a good guy. He's a good guy? Um, we been basic, I just wanna ask you basic questions uh, about the city. And uh, you know- It's falling apart as we speak. It is falling apart as we speak. Uh, they say they're putting a casino down in the uh, the Harbor Mall parking lot. Right. Did you hear about that? Well, with the shot to see if it's, um, you know, it makes out all right. I know yeah. they had one in here years ago, it didn't make out too all right. Though. There was a casino here? Yeah. Many, see, many I didn't know it. Ago. See, I'm only 31, so. It only lasted a couple of weeks, though. A couple of weeks? You want to sit down and take a break? I got it. All right. Will, uh, Will, Will Flanagan, how you feel about that guy and the job he's doing? Uh, he's a good guy. He's, uh, he does his best he can, but, uh, you know, it's done all right for the city for a long time. Yeah. You know, but just, uh, it's putting it on the right foot. You know, there's a lot of stuff they can do, and they don't come around and do it. What about, what about uh, all the, uh, the, uh, the gangs, the drugs, and the prostitution? I mean, it can be fixed, though. He should, he should, he's, you think he's doing enough to stop the prostitution? Because there's still yeah, a lot of prostitution. The, the cops' job. Basically, you can't stop at all, anyway. Yeah. The town, a lot of, a lot of the problem with Four Rivers, they lose, uh, lose a lot of their business going out of town. Yeah. So, the, the, to the tourist to cities. Stop, huh? To the tourist cities, yeah, like well, Newport. To the largest cities, basically. When, when you have problems. tourism, when you have tourism, yeah. you have money, right? More or less, yeah, not always the case because, uh, you know, in the same token, they have a lot of more damage, too. What kind of damage? Like, you know, the uh, building, roads, stuff like that. They're the first ones. That oh, like graffiti, like b-boys tagging the buildings no, up? Uh, they don't have that much. That's not, uh, you got to keep the city more or less. Like clean. fires. Uh, there's another problem. They need to put up the jobs, basically, for these people to work. So Jobs, no jobs in the city. That's what everybody when I interview, that's what they the, say. There's, there's jobs in the city, but it's not enough for everybody. I, mean, I asked you already, and uh, you told me uh, polio. You you have polio? That's the reason why the crutches? Yeah, I've had polio since I was two years old. Since you were two? People say the rumor is that uh, you were that this is new. They're saying this is new, which I've, I've seen you like for years like this. They're saying that you were, uh, for part of my friends, being an asshole, being a jerk in the middle of the street, and you got hit by a car. That's false. No, that's false, buddy. Yeah. I had this since I was a kid. I was uh, considered uh, permanently disabled since I was a kid. So you were in the middle of the street, going crazy, drunk, and you got hit by a car. I've gotten hit by a car, yeah, but not. Oh, but, so you uh, did. So, uh, so it's I've true. I've gotten hit by a car, but uh, it didn't cause my polio. Oh, no, but it didn't cause the, you know, uh, those crutches. Like this Oh, all right. So that is a story. That is a true story that you it got hit by true. a car. It's half, it's half, I got hit by a couple of cars already, not just one car. Damn, a couple of cars? Yeah. Fuck is wrong with these people? Uh, like, crazy drivers, man. How'd that work out for you when you got hit by the car? <laughs> how did you go? Yeah, you, you're up. Feel good. They send you over the roof of the car, or? <laughs> yeah, well, it didn't feel too good, but uh, you know, I've had, I have had worse falls actually. So. Yeah, uh, worse uh, falls like, like what? Mean like that. What, falling off a house? Uh, yeah, actually, falling. yeah. Matter of fact, I fell off this house over here one time when I lived over here. You, what, you jumped out the window? Yeah. Was it fire or something? Or you were tripping on shrooms no, or something? Corn, you jumped I got, out? I got cornered <laughs> by fucking like 30 mad men with machine guns. I had no choice except to jump out the Which window. one? This house? Yeah. You got cornered by 30 men with machine guns? Yeah, Get out of here. I swear to God. Get out of here with machine guns, like AKs? Yeah, machine guns. You know machine guns? Yeah, yeah. There's all kinds. I had to fucking jump out the fucking window over here. You had to jump out the window. That's nuts. Uh -huh. What did they do? They shoot out the window at you? Yeah, they shot at me. Do you have any bullet uh, holes? Uh, yeah, actually. Can you show us? Huh? Can, well, yeah, no, you... it, wasn't, it was a long time ago. I don't, they're pretty much all healed by now. But... How many times did you get shot? Uh, actually, I think like two or three. Two or three shots? You don't remember two or three? It was one or the other, right? No, I just, I had not too much time to think about it, though. I yeah. know I got hit 
once on each arm and I think once in the stomach and I just uh. fucking bolted out the window. All stopped and came chasing me down and so yep. freaking had to jump out the fucking window. What, third floor or? Yeah. Holy yeah. fuck. And that didn't do that to your legs. Huh? Yeah, that's the polio. No, I had uh. this already. So you were, you were like having to limp out the damn window, huh? One of the guys hit me, uh, I believe, I don't, I believe it was outside. Hit me in my freaking leg, man. When you were already outside? Yeah, I man, think, that's I a think crazy. I got hit like four times, four times or three times. You might get popular for that story on on the internet when oh, people hear nothing, that. Buddy. No, that's not. That's nothing. Buddy. Wait, you got a better crazier one? Let me hear that's a good crazy. one. Let me hear a good one. I got Las Vegas though. Las so Vegas. I go in there, and freaking somebody gives me a job and work in the casino. Yeah. Fucking. Uh, the guy goes in there, Japanese guy goes and spends like seventy-five million dollars. That's my job to convince him to spend the money. Uh huh. So he's all sweating it out. Like, don't spend it if you don't have the money to spend it. Right. You know, just walk away. Yeah. He wants to spend $75 million, so I have to call upstairs and tell the boss that this guy wants to spend $75 million. Yeah. He's like, well, if you can get him this, I'll give you my split. Uh. So next day, uh, basically, he spent the money, left, all crying, Japanese guy. Crying, he lost 75. This is no joke. What, one 75. shot deal? One shot, half hour. Dude. Oh my god, he lost Ooh, 75. 75 million lost. So, what'd you make out of that? Huh? What do you I didn't make? I get to make nothing. Oh. I'm gonna finish the story right oh, now. Alright, go ahead. The boss told me somebody parked their car uh, uh, outside, parked it wrong. So, I go check up on it. Freaking guys, Japanese guys that come in and eight of them with Japanese swords, dude. Come so on. I said, Samurai guy, sword? And about 30 others fucking behind them with machine guns. The cops get there. They start getting in on it. They start shooting. Nice. Well, you know, it's like fucking 300 people shooting at me, dog. I fucking get in the fucking Callaway, fucking vet somebody's car. I fucking take off. Well, you just, like GTA, you just grab some random car and just went. Random car, I fucking had pop to take the ignition off, dude. and just go, right? Just go. Fucking get on the highway. They chase me. Nevada police chase me all the way from Las Vegas to fucking Connecticut. Why did the cops chase you? You didn't rob the money. Huh? Huh? The, the Chinese guys had the. To kill. I don't know why. That's what I'm saying. The cops were chasing you, but they weren't going after the Japanese guys with the swords. I I, I know why. You want to know why? Because those guys are important. They actually live in, uh, in Las Vegas. Yeah. Right, they're hot shots over there. Oh, so they let them get away with it. So they let them get away. They Shit. wanted. They thought I stole the money from them. Oh man. They called and told them that I stole the money from. Be the honest, Japanese you stole guys. seven. You stole seventy-five million from no. a Japanese guy, didn't you? <laughs> yeah, right. No. Buddy. You wouldn't be standing on the corner of Beverage Street. No, they be all looking for me. Hold the fucking Japan over here, buddy. Nice. No, I didn't do that. But I did spill like fucking one hundred and thirty-eight cars. Police cars on the highway, dude. 138 police cars, what? What right do you on mean? The highway from Nevada to fucking Chasing Connecticut. You? 138 cars? Damn. Police cars. Man, they were, they were huh? trying to get your ass. Yeah, they wouldn't stop, though. That's a yeah. long drive, dude. Do you know how many miles that is? Dude. Yeah, from Nevada to what? What? Colorado? To Connecticut. Oh. And they chased that far? Damn. Yeah, dude. Nevada police, huh? Holy Nevada shit. Nevada police. Try to stop for them fucking three times. Every time I try to stop them, they fired shots into my car, dude. Fuck that. I would keep I'm going, like, too. Huh? I would keep going, too. I had no choice. That's what You slam your can't cr th crutches together in the air. Why do you do that? Why do I slam my crutches? Yeah, why do you smack them together in the air and, uh, and yell just, stuff? Uh, just bored, buddy. Can you do it for us one time huh? so they can see it, the way you, the way uh, you do it? I can't do that, buddy. No? Ah, uh, come on. One time. Uh, do it the way you always do it, where you smack uh, them up in the air. One time. Ah, uh, uh, come on. So you're gonna, you, what are you gonna do this summer? You're gonna be standing out on the corner? I have no choice, buddy. I have, honestly, I don't have no choice, buddy. Asking this people for I cigarettes do. and, uh... So I have to survive, buddy. I, my money does not, I don't make enough money. Your money doesn't grow on trees, right? I'm kind of retired, man, from, uh, from all the action stuff. I'm trying to stay away from it, but... You're retired from what? All the action stuff. All the action-packed Jean-Claude Van Damme type yeah, stuff? stuff. So I just want to see you smack your crutches one time. Uh, Do it on the ground, low, so we, nobody uh, can see it. Go uh, low down here. No? All right, Roy, high five. All right, buddy. High stay five. Out, stay out of the Yeah. <laughs> Fucking guy told me that he jumped out of that third floor window because guys came in with machine guns shooting at him. 30 guys with machine guns. Shot him once in the arm, once in the other arm, the other in the stomach. So then he decides to jump out that third floor window, lands on the ground and runs. And he tells me a story that uh, 
he's at a casino. The Japanese guy gives him $75 million at a casino in Las Vegas to place a bet. He uh, puts the money in. The guy supposedly lost all $75 million in a half an hour and then uh, comes back the next day with 30 more Japanese guys with samurai swords and machine guns.